Hi, my name is Tiali, um, and I've been a Christ follower um, since being in South Africa seven years ago. I always considered myself a happy-going person and was like, I have joy, um, and didn't fully understand what that meant until 2016 when my brother had passed away. But through God's presence, His Word, and through community, God has given me a way better understanding of what joy means. And when I say the joy of the Lord is my strength, I understand that within my heart what that means. So now I'm going to perform a spoken word on joy. Joy, what a tiny little word we infuse with great meaning, defining it by our earthly needing. But what if joy is not striving for all affection, for people, stuff, possession, our dreams of picture perfection? What if joy is not a life of our choosing, so full of promise, yet full of deception? A million disappointments shaping our needs and strife, setting before ourselves different goals for life. Joy is not having souls that starve or sinking further into the wheel of behaving. With our credit cards of getting ignoring and ignoring, lying to ourselves about what has most meaning. I think we know that we know. Great joy is real. It's been written on our hearts in hits all around. Creation, beauty, art. So maybe all joy needs is a new point of view, a true north of existence, like things we know that are true, that needs can be met, such as hunger getting food. Darkness has light, for fatigue there is rest, our thirst can be quenched, and when lonely, there are friends. So if needs can be met, it's logical surely, there's a joy that's findable, one that can fill me. If no earthly treasures can sate it, our search needs to spread. The answer lies elsewhere. It requires looking heavenward. Joy is love, and no love is greater than the love laying itself down for another. Joy comes in the form of God choosing a manger, the creator born to his own world as a stranger. A fugitive from birth, though the only perfect life live, this man of sorrow sent by his father to convert the lost into sons and daughters. Joy is God choosing a cross taken in eternity sentence meant for us. Joy is this offer of offers with acceptance its only catch. Though it's free for us, know that he paid the great cost. Joy is our eternal alliance with a love never failing, a trust with reliance, a peace that's unending. Joy is the God of all glory. It is my hand taking his, inviting his hand already holding me.